I just cracked the code. With all sorts of images and teasers coming out, they're all leading towards some sort of eclipse. There's theories that this eclipse will eventually lead to the moon crashing into the island, or even worse. But it shouldn't be what's happening after the eclipse, it's what's causing the eclipse. Because the Fortnite moon and sun cycle have been the same ever since day one. So what would get in between of moon and sun in order to cause a red moon or eclipse? But I've just cracked the code. There's been these glyphs on this wall for this whole season. I've had some theories about it being the cube cradle and the pyramid, and those are 100% correct. I mean, it just makes sense. If I show you this, you're gonna believe it too, okay? It's literally picture for picture, just it's the same. The only thing that's a little bit weird about this is these little circles. There's one circle on the left half covered, and there's one on the right. Well, it turns out that in Chapter 2 Season 7, there was an Eclipse teaser that happened to have a lot to do with the last reality, because that was a last reality-based season. It says they're coming with a lunar eclipse image underneath. We didn't know what this meant. Even Donald Mustard posted a red moon, like, years ago. Basically, if you don't know, a blood moon occurs whenever there is no sunlight hitting the moon. So something has to be blocking the moon. These two circles happen to be the moon and the sun. The moon on the left hand, and it's already starting to be covered by the cube cradle, hence why it's half covered. And the right one being the sun. Eventually, the moon would go fully behind the cube cradle, turning it into a blood moon. And I believe that this is how the cube cradle will be revealed to us. Dr. Sloan says that there is a signal coming our way that she's seen before eons ago, but she couldn't quite make out what it was. It happened to be the cube cradle. Now, there's also rumors that the ice moon will collide with the island. There is some really strong evidence towards that, one being a concept that even Fortnite themselves posted onto their website and deleted later that showed monsters trapped in ice on our new map. And if you didn't know, back in Chapter 1 Season 7, when part of the Ice Moon came to our island, there was a monster trapped inside. Now, if you want to know what's wrong with this theory and how Jones might actually be returning, click the video on the screen. I promise you'll love it.